Hey guys, Mrs. Rainey here. Just wanted to do a quick two minute tutorial about this week's lesson. I hope you all are safe and well and warm um, after last week. So if you, if anybody needs anything, email me or Zoom me at my emergency Zoom link. I sent out the email with an emergency Zoom link in it um, last night. So I wanted to talk a little bit about your assignments for this week. We're gonna do a review. We're reviewing portraits on your homepage in Canvas. Every homepage, whether you're Art 1, Art 2, or Art 3, I have added an emergency link here like uh, for our Ice Mageddon lesson plans. You can see right here, it says week of 222 current. That is your current lesson. Um, and then right here to the right, Mrs. Rainey's attendance link. This is your attendance link. It's date and time stamped. That means it records the date and the time that you sign it and fill out that Google form. It must be filled out each day for attendance. So Monday and Wednesday are uh, first, third, fifth, and seventh period. Tuesday and Thursday are two, four, six, and eight period. So those days you need to sign this attendance link for art, okay? And then Friday is every single class period. So if you're in first period, you need to sign the link on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If you are in second period art with me, you need to sign this link on Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. All right, Ice Mageddon lesson plans. Let's click on them. This is easy peasy, okay? So it says here, it's one assignment. As soon as you click that link from the homepage, this is your assignment. This is where you'll submit your assignment. This is where you're gonna read your instructions. You can click on these instructions and it is going to pop up the Google slideshow. This is more than one page. There are four additional slides. So make sure you scroll through the slides to view your options, okay? Um, the instructions are to choose one. I don't want anybody thinking they have to draw four portraits this week. I just want you to draw one portrait. We've all done portrait units, so this is review. So this should not be too difficult. Um, you can do this in your sketchbook or you can do it on any piece of paper you have, okay? Um, printer paper is fine. You're a full clean page though. I want you to use a full clean page of paper um, and use any drawing supplies you have, okay? So be creative. Your project is due February 26th. It's due in Canvas under that assignment, okay? On, on the homepage, that assignment is right there. Option one is to draw a portrait of a family member, all right? Choose any family member, your mom, sibling, uncle, grandparent, whoever. Ask them to sit for you so you can draw them from observation, okay? Or you may take a photograph of them. As long as you take the picture with your cell phone, then you can draw based off of that photograph. Totally fine, okay? Um, option two, self-portrait without a mask. I wanna see your beautiful smiling faces or you don't have to smile. Um, I wanna see your sweet faces, okay? No mask, do a self-portrait without a mask. Again, you can take a selfie with your cell phone or your device and draw from that or you can look in a mirror and draw from observation. Option three is a self-portrait as an animal. If you've already done a split self-portrait, some of my Art 3 students did a split selfie this year. If, if that was you, you need to pick a different option. I don't wanna see a split self-portrait or self-portrait with an animal from somebody who's already done one like that this year, okay? We're gonna do, we're, we're reviewing our portrait unit, but we're not doing the same exact thing we did before. So um, that's only, I think only my art threes did that. So if you're an art one or art two and you love this option, choose it, go for it. This is, you know, what animal you relate to, what's your favorite animal, what animal you think would be interesting to split with your own face. Use the facial proportion guidelines we studied in class. We've gone over portraits. That's review for everybody. Last option, option four, is a self-portrait as a Lego. This is a fun one. Draw yourself as a Lego. Build clothes, hair, and accessories to express who you are and include a background. Okay, so these are your four options. Again, only draw one. I don't want anybody drawing four portraits. Just draw one portrait this week. Pick the option that you like the best or that you think is the most interesting. And when you go back, this is the assignment. It's all right here. So if you're in the home page for art, it tells you just click on the week, the current week. That's this week. And this is your assignment all right here. Okay. When you're ready to submit your assignment, you'll submit it. it needs to be a a picture just like we've been submitting all year if you can't get your picture to upload 
you can put your picture in a Google presentation and type the link into the box, okay? So you should be able to upload it. Here is the rubric with the criteria by which I'll be grading your portrait. I hope you guys have fun. If you need me this week, refer back to that email for my office hours, 8.30 to 10.30 and 1 to 3, and hit that emergency Zoom link, and I would love to see you on Zoom. Take care, everyone.